I love reading books, man, but I'm lazy. I, I'd rather get the audio tape. Uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? I'd rather, I'd rather me. write a book. Fuck uh, reading a book. I don't want to read nobody's story. I want niggas to read I'm my lazy. story. I'm lazy. Even writing a book, I'd rather just dictate. No homo. What up? <laughs> I could tell you, but I don't want to let go of my secrets. Rumble Fish. I read that shit when I was in school. The first book I ever read that made me like reading was Catching a Rod. Because I was in like elementary school. And it's just the first book I ever read that had curses in it. I was like, oh shit, there's curses in books in school? After that, I was hooked on books. You know what I mean? The Book of Secrets, Osho. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> Previous lifetimes. I know I was a scientist in my past life. You know what I'm saying? Shit. I probably was, I don't know, I probably was a, you know what I'm saying? A wolf running in the fucking wilderness, just tearing shit up. You know what I'm saying? Running wild, free. You know what I'm saying? I think I was a bear. That's why I like a lot of fish. Phoenix. That's the same question you asked Inspector Deck. And he said, I don't know, maybe pork. <laughs> I mean, me five Pussy. chicken. Pussy! Fried chicken. Oh, excuse my mouth. Damn, Sorry, son. You wilding out, son. <laughs> it's like little kids and everybody over there. Wow. At least they're girls. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> my last meal, if I was on death row, you know what I'm saying? Side the shake night. I'll be like, give me some fried chicken, macaroni, screen beans, mashed potatoes, apple pie, red velvet cake. Red velvet. All that. I, I think, want it all. My last meal would be the Straight thing up. that I like to eat, eat the most. You know, crab legs, lobster, fried chicken wings. Yeah. You know, some nice little salad. Yo, and you soup. gotta, but yo, you gotta have a for dessert a blunt. You know what I'm saying some Kush rolled in a grape swisher. That's my last meal. Then you can hang me. Fuck it. I don't play games. Eat candy. Smile a joke. Metroid. Yo, I don't even play video games. That was the only game I was I was rocking. I think it was ColecoVision, or it was it was it was it was before Xbox and all that. Metroid, man, it was just crazy. I like the boxing games. I don't play video games no more. I ain't got no time for that shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. We used to play when I did, it was but, but, basketball. But we used to play Punch Out. You know what I'm saying? We used to be on Rock. That was dope. Bar. Up in the, up in the, the, the spot where they sold weed at, we was little kids in the game room, and we used to play punch out. That was the big game back in the days. You know what I'm saying? I'll put you up on game, Dig Dug, Jam Master J. Yeah, Jam Master J set that studio session up, and that was you know that was before like that was before Biggie was Biggie. Yeah, that was before Biggie was. I mean, that was before we even really knew who Puff was. I remember the first time I seen Puff. The nigga had a Helly, Helly Hansen jacket on, jewelry and shit, curly, like, that's curly and shit. I'm like, yo, who the fuck is this nigga? Jay like, yo, that's Puff and shit. He run, he run, he's, he's that nigga. I'm like, all right, well, you know, all right, I ain't know. But that was an ill session, man, you know what I'm saying? First time we met Biggie, it was just crazy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Big was that dude. Or Big was, like, humble, like, you know what I'm saying? Real cool dude. And I knew he was gonna be, you know what I'm saying, that dude when I heard his voice. So I mean that session was yeah, crazy. He had a deep voice, son. Tretch from Naughty by Nation, Vinny All was there. Jesse West. You know what I'm saying? The whole official NAS was in the building. It was it was an L night, man. L night for the Hit Hip Factory. Nah, we just reached out to them niggas, man. You know, the remix we shut them down. I mean, Big Pun was popping at the time, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Before he passed, Big Pun was that nigga. You know what I'm saying? And we had to get him on the record, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know what I'm saying? We just, he respected us every time He's we seen that nigga. He's the for their knowledge and wisdom. He gave show us respect. You know what I'm saying? Two hip hop new was the most violent edition. Hmm. Man, I almost worked with almost everybody I wanted to work with. Just about. The people I want to work with ain't even here no more. Mm. Like Marvin Gaye. Donnie Bob Hathaway. Molly, you know what I'm saying? Those are Bob. people that, that I want to work with, man. You know? I mean... I always wanted to do a song with Slick Rick. I love Slick Rick. He, he helped invent Sticky Fingers, you know what I'm saying? He don't even know it. Or maybe he do, who knows. What? in my pockets? Ain't shit in my pockets, because I'm just coming downstairs to do the interview. <laughs> but I, I might have a four-fifth in my pocket, but we ain't showing you that. What's in your pockets, man? Now, I got a question for you. What's in your motherfucking pockets, man? <laughs> Like I told my wife, I got a fetish for noses. They got to have a cute nose. <laughs>
tell my wife when I met her, I like the your nose. The nose, nose. <laughs> that's, it's, a, it's some simple shit, but that's, you know, I ain't into all that other freaky What's shit. What's up? You know what I'm saying? What's up? What's <laughs> up? I got a fetish for cleanliness, you know what I mean? JJ got a smell like agua, straight cheese, everything got to be clean, fresh, you know what I mean? Groomed, nice. Otherwise, I cannot partake. If you like, I can load one up in this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? And we can play Russian roulette. You wanna play Russian roulette? Let's see. Let's see if this is my turn to go. <laughs> Yo, if I blow my brains out on national TV, I, I, I always wanted to be on bear from TV and faces of death. So if if I blow my brains out, it's a rap, so <laughs> this would be the ill way to go out, right? Ooh. <laughs> Let's try one more time. Rotate it a little bit. I'm not even gonna look. I'm not gonna look. I'm not gonna look. I'm not gonna look. Rotate it. I'm gonna try one more time. I swear to God. Oh, God. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Section six, nigga. <laughs> Kids don't try that at home. What happened was I was in um, Toronto filming that TV show Platinum. And um, as you can see, I was twisted. We had like 10 bottles of Hennessy. And yeah, it's pretty stupid. Probably never do that again. I'm pretty lucky, you know what I'm saying? Lucky to still be here, yeah. Our legacy, our legacy is, is, is not just us, you know what I'm saying? We came in the game to run DMC, so you know what I'm saying? We share that legacy already. You know what I'm saying? And rest in peace to X1 and Big DS. A lot of the legacy in here, so what I want our legacy to be remembered as is that we just brought that mad face to music. That's it, you know what I'm saying? That mad face, that slam dancing, that angst, that energy, that creativeness, the storytellings. Just ill, real dudes, man. From day one, you know what I mean? To the last day. Untreality, y'all. That was it. <laughs>